Detroit Hot Radio, WDHR, the heart and soul of Detroit music. Stay tuned for Let's Talk About It with your host, T. Pablo. Right here on DetroitHotRadio.com. This is Jay Ray, who got the outstanding music. Y'all gonna love his music, I'm telling you. He got the girl screaming. He's a nice looking guy. And he's a young guy, so he's got a lot of mileage and he's ready to go. Without further ado, we're gonna talk to Jay Ray. How you doing, Jay Ray? Man, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Thanks a lot. Appreciate the intro. Oh yeah, no doubt about it. No doubt about it. It's good to have you on the show. How you feel today? I'm feeling good, man. I just um actually I'm just getting off work. I'm an artist, but I also <laughs> work full time, so I'm literally just getting off work at seven. You're a smart artist, so that's a wonderful thing that you're doing. And keep your art alive. We got some music by you. So first of all, people want to know, are you a Detroiter? Born and raised in Detroit. What school? I went to Detroit School of Arts. That was your high school? Yep. Wow. No wonder your music sounds so good. That's outstanding. When did you get into music? Um, I actually started singing like when I was a little kid. I mean, all my life I've been kind of shy. And then it was one time I was on a church bus and I was singing. And there was one of the church leaders was like, ah, oh, you sound good. And I was like a little kid. And from that point on, I had in my head like, oh, I can sing. And then as I went to school, got more involved with school, choir, and church, it just became a passion. And then I decided when I was 19 that I wanted to do it professionally. And I recorded my first song and been at it since then, really. When you're in the studio, do you have any input on the mixing or the mastering? Yeah, I do. My producer is crazy dope. His name is Darrell Campbell. We're going to send a shout out there to Darrell Campbell. Yeah, but man, he's crazy talented. But yeah, that's one of the reasons why I continue to work with him because it's a collaboration. He appreciates and listens to my input and what I'm trying to bring to life with the music. That's outstanding. Who writes your music? Do you do most of the writing or is that a collaboration? Um, I write most of it. Sometimes when I'm in the studio, like, I might not know how I want to say something. Like, I know what I want to say, but don't know the best way to say it or put it in, into the song. And so, yeah, that's where the producer comes in sometimes. And so, yeah, it's a collaboration with that, too. For the most part, yeah, I write most of it myself. We're going to go ahead and listen to some of your music. And the first one out of the box is going to be bad one. That's my favorite. Well, I got a bunch of favorites. You know, I have to text. They so good, I, I can't say which one is the best, but they're all my favorite. We're going to play this song called Bad One by J. Ray. I think you're going to like it. So without further ado, we'll be right back after this. From the east side to the west side and throughout the world, this is a Detroit original. Detroit Hot Radio. <laughs> Oh, 
I'm a monster corner She's my little bad one She's bad but she good for me She good for me She good for me You're good for me Girl you're good for me She good for me Good for me You're good for me You're so so good to me Hey, I've been meaning to ask you, where'd you get that lipstick? It's Tantas, Tantas Cosmetics by Nadanya. Girl, they have over 42 vibrant hues of the sheerest of pure to the boldness of cobalt blue. Wow. With exciting shades of nude, pink, red, and orange, and anything in between. Well, I just love it. Can I find it online? Yes, at TantasCosmetics.com. It's a deal. I'm going on TantasCosmetics.com. And you can find it at Macy's, 12 Oaks, Novi, Michigan, and Lenox Mall in Atlanta, Georgia. It's Tantas, Tantas Cosmetics by Nadanya. This is how grown folk music is supposed to sound. Real good. This is Real R&B. Detroit Hot Radio. WDHR. The heart and soul of Detroit music. Now, on with the show. Right here on DetroitHotRadio.com. That song. How did you come up with that song? I actually had like a bunch of tracks that some producers had sent me. There was this track. It was like a classical type beat to it. It kind of reminded me of somebody I used to have a crush on or whatnot. Uh oh. So that's where the concept of the song came in. But I literally wrote it to this classical type beat. Took it to the studio to record it, and then my producer was like, "Man, eh, it's sweet, but the beat." He was just like, you know, it, it don't really fit the direction that we're trying to go with the album. So I was like, well, let's try to see what you can do with it. He made the track, like, completely took it to another level. Yeah. It got some different movement. Even at one time, it felt like a little house going on, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah. To be bumping and stuff. I really like that song. It's a combination of romantic and dance. Yeah, I yeah. Really, I really like that. How, where have you performed that? Have you performed all over the world or nationally or locally or? I haven't performed all over the world yet, <laughs> but uh, that's definitely one of the goals. I've done some local performances. Um, I've done some out of town stuff. Um, mainly, most of what I do is in Detroit, though, because I work and like it's kind of challenging, you know, trying to get time off to do music and stuff and work full time. Let me be the first to say it on this radio station, ladies and gentlemen. His music is going to take him around the world. Ain't no question about it. We don't want to take up all the time talking about these people. Want to hear your music, man? We talked about it and talked about it. This next song, the ladies really loves this song. As a matter of fact, Misty Love, the founder of the Detroit Black Music Awards, said you better play this song by J. Ray. So we play it. <laughs> <laughs> it's called I'd Rather. We're gonna talk about this song once we hear it, ladies and gentlemen. And this goes out to the ladies. Well, all this songs really goes out to the ladies. You, I think you're gonna like it. This is I'd Rather by J. Ray. We'll be back. After this, from the east side to the west side and throughout the world, this is a Detroit original, Detroit Hot Radio. It's you. Just you and me The way it's supposed to be The conversation's just right And then a lit by candlelight It's getting closer to the time at night And I don't wanna leave No, no Cause I like it when you laugh at me And my jokes ain't even funny
I just wanna spend the, I just wanna spend the night with you, you. I just wanna spend the, spend the night with you. Clock strikes, it's the number nine. I'm contemplating if I'm gonna make a move. You're looking so good, girl. Ooh, I think I could, girl. Make this moment a very special moment. Yeah, a forever kind of moment that you won't regret. I hope you like it when I cling to you. I never wanna let you go, girl. And do you like it when I sing to you? You'll be so cute. I hate to have to leave. I'd rather say goodbye. Are you looking for gentle dentistry at an affordable price? Pay us a visit at Hardin Family Dentistry. We're located at 7411 John R. Street in Detroit. We have affordable prices. We accept most insurance plans and flexible hours. Call us for your appointment today at 313-871-1999, 313-871-1999, or visit us on MyDetroitDentist.com. Come and smile with us. Now, on with the show. Right here on DetroitHotRadio.com. We're back. J Ray. Yep, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> that song I'd rather, man. So it's a candlelight song. How did you write this song? Um, that song is actually based on relationship. Um, actually, not my relationship, though. Mm-hmm. It's based on someone else's relationship. And it's funny because a lot of people don't realize that artists don't always write about their own personal life. They write about other people's. So I was inspired by somebody else, a friend of mine, just telling me about their uh, you know, relationship issues or whatnot. And that's kind of where that song came from. That's nice. I like that. I like that story. Are you married? No, I'm not married. So what are your aspirations right now? What do you want to do? What are you trying to do? I would like to be successful with my music career. I mean, that's my passion. That's what I want to do. And it's not about fame. Like, I don't need to be famous. My goal is to just be successful, to be able to support myself and 
eventually my family doing what I love to do and not just working a job or something that I don't really love. This is what my dad told me. He said, when you can find something that you really like to do, you do well, and you can get paid doing it, you blessed and you never work a day in your life. Some people sure. just seek to be famous to be known. Like, to me, it's not really about that. I just say I don't want that. Or like, if it happened, it happened. But I'd rather just be able to support myself and be financially stable. That's a humble way of looking at it. And people appreciate humbleness. You just keep doing the music. We'll make it happen for you. Right. <laughs> this next song, Back to the Basics. Now, this song, y'all, ladies and gentlemen, gives you a glimpse of his talent, of his multiplicity, the things that he can do with his talent. It's a beautiful thing. And you're going to really, really enjoy this song. And listen to the different types of movements in this music. This is the type of talent this young brother got. We're going to take a short pause for the cause. And right behind that is J. Ray, Back to the Basics. We'll be right back after this. From the east side to the west side and throughout the world. This is a Detroit original, Detroit Hot Radio. Do you remember? As the love goes, we shall I remember. Talking on the phone at night Making each other better Now it's all complicated We can't even figure out When we should be together Yeah Yeah I remember You made me up the meal zone Dancing never felt so good to me Let's get back to the basics Oh Love you the love is new Detroit Hot Radio, WDHR, the heart and soul of Detroit music. Since November 2016, the Black Gold Movement has been working to create a new reality for black people. One that we can own, control, and pass to our children. A black nation within this nation. We need your help to create this by becoming a supporting member of the Black Gold Nation for just a monthly fee of $4. 
Invest by going to www.blackgold-wakandarising.com and clicking support now. Now, on with the show. Right here on DetroitHotRadio.com. All right, let's get back to the basics, man. I felt like I wanted to play my percussions on that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, it got a nice rhythm, like nice little beat to it. Yeah, hustle to it. Yeah. So, uh, how did you come up with that idea? Before you get started, we got somebody want to talk to you. Okay, we got to get these callers. If we don't, they get mad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good evening, caller. Welcome to Let's Talk About It. What's your name and where are you calling from? Hello, this is Andrea, your social media marketing manager for Detroit High Radio. This your girl right here, ain't it? <laughs> yeah, how you doing? I'm we doing got, fine. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we got Andrea LB. She's called in. She just couldn't help herself. She had to talk to Jay Ray. She's the social media marketing manager for Detroit High Radio. She single-handedly took us around the world with her stuff. She's one of the best in the business. Also one of the best graphic designers in the business. I just want to welcome Jay Ray to Detroit Hot Radio tonight. Just let him know how much I admire his music. Back to the Basics caught my attention, your CD. I thought it was the biggest prize ever, and I just appreciate your music. It's something that I think women should really pay attention to what you're saying. It do touch what other people are going through and how men feel about girls and how girls feel about men. And your music is just awesome. Thank you. I really appreciate that. And also, I want to say congratulations to all the nominees that you got this year. Oh, thank you, thank you. He was nominated by the Detroit Black Music Awards. The people nominated him by voting. He was nominated under what category? Best Recording Song. Okay, Best Recorded Song. I'm sure he's going to win more awards as he goes. I think he's up for a Detroit High Radio Award. Am I right, Andrew? Yes. Oh, good. We're so glad you called. Now, Jay Ray. I have to give credit to my producer for this song, really, because um, his idea. Oh. We was just in the studio one day, and he was just like, man, you got to have something for people to hustle to, to vibe to, whatever. Something they got a nice groove to it, and we just, like, literally started from scratch with a line. And I think the line was, let's get back to the basics. And we literally started with that line and created a whole song around that line. I think that line is fantastic. It tells people there are some basic things about love. We try to go beyond the basics when you're trying to live life. But if you get the basics right, right. everything will fall in place. Uh, right. And that song says that. Now this next song, I am not the one. I didn't listen to your whole CD. I just put the ones down that I like. We're going to listen to a lot. This is another one that's my favorite. But you know, I'm going to tell you something, J-Ray. I know you got a lot of music on that CD you gave me. Mm -hmm. About 15 songs maybe? 15, I think. Listen, I'm going to give you some wisdom here, but you can do what you want, but I'm going to give you some wisdom. Every one of those songs will see it. Stevie Wonder said this. Well, look, I'm putting a lot of hits on one CD when I can sell one hit at a time and have hits forever. Feel me? Right. Well, this next song is called I'm Not The One, and we're going to listen to this song. This is the first controversial song right now. He talking about he ain't the one. So we're going to find out what he's saying. Right? <laughs> <laughs> this is Jay Ray. I'm Not The One. you asked for Even though I could I probably won't And I could be the reason why you smile so bright Girl, I know you wish that I would But I probably won't I know the thought of it just drives you crazy
I'm performing, I listen to Detroit Hot Radio. Plays all the music that we all love. Detroit Hot Radio. Now, on with the show. Right here on DetroitHotRadio.com. We're back. I know people were kind of surprised. We did a 360 with that song. It just went off. It's so pretty. It's so far longing. How did you come up with that song? That was another song that we just collaborated on. If you listen to the album from beginning to end, it basically is like a story. It's telling the story. It's like a roller coaster ride of being in different um, relationships, being in different situations, having different emotions. The final song, not the one, is basically the end of that story when you realize that you have been through all this, this ups and downs or whatnot, you realize that you not the right person. You're not the one for this person. So that's what the song is about. I mean, it's just the, the, the ending of the story. You know, breakup is probably the saddest thing in a person's life unless you just one of those crazies and don't care nothing about a person and, you know, go to hell, you know, whatever. <laughs> yeah, you know, breakups is one of the most saddest parts of life, man. On somebody's part, on both parts, especially when you grow Grow apart and you agree to disagree and you have to leave each other because you agree to disagree so the best thing to do is say well you go your way I go my way but it's always painful but when you don't yeah. want it to break up and the other person do it's almost some people can't cope with that yeah, that's true. do you play any instruments I play a little bit piano but I don't really should have been taking lessons you write your music by ear right oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah like I, I can write I can sit and write when singers I understand you know you're an artist and you just feel stuff and when you write on that keyboard Boy, man, keep doing it now. Don't stop because you don't have feels like Oscar Peterson. The fact of the matter is, when somebody say, "Do you write your music?" Say, yeah. How do you do? That? I do it on piano. That's enough right there. I have had some training, so I know okay. basic theory and stuff like okay. that. Like I know chords and key and changes and all that stuff. So I'm not like musically illiterate. <laughs> but yeah, I, um, I do want to eventually take get a little bit more serious about piano lessons. So. That's wonderful because when you said theory. I, and I was just talking to me and Andrew were talking about theory a couple of days ago, I think. But when you talk about theory, that last song went where you didn't expect it to go, if you will. With theory, you kind of know where it's going to go. But you went against the grain. Like, you took it somewhere. It was good. Surprising. Refreshing. It told the story passionately. So you right. took it there. And that was great, man. Keep up with your music. Let's sound great. This next song, While It Lasted, I can come up with a lot of While It Lasted in a relationship. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> so we'll let the people hear the song. I'm not saying anything. So ladies and gentlemen, this is Jay Ray, While It Lasted. And we'll be right back after this. From the east side to the west side and throughout the world, this is a Detroit original. Detroit Hot Radio. Let me explain that I'm doing this 
local Detroit listening area and you need an income earning opportunity, the following information may be for you. Would you get a pen and pencil at this time because at the end of the announcement, a phone number will be given. A local Detroit company is working on a money-making opportunity. They are dedicated to helping individuals, families, and neighborhoods by providing an economic opportunity to persons with a good work ethic. This company is a privately held family corporation with a proven track record of success for over 55 years. They just announced an income opportunity that you can take advantage of immediately, part-time or full-time. Interested parties should call 248-470-2085. Ask for Al and tell them you heard it on Detroit Hot Radio. Don't miss out on this great opportunity. Be sure to call 248-470-2085. Again, that number is 248 470 Two zero eight five. Thank you. Now on with the show right here on Detroit Hot Radio dot com. We are back, Jerry. Yes, sir. How did you come up with that song? Uh, that song was actually based on a, a real situation, realizing that you messed up and wasn't doing what you're supposed to be doing, and then when everything is over, you like trying to figure out how to make things better. And you basically in your head like, I got all these explanations of why I could, why I couldn't do right, or why I messed up, or whatnot. So uh, I mean, that's where it, was, it, it comes from. It's, it's based on a true situation. This is another one I like. Now this song is "Baby Is You," ladies and gentlemen. I'm sure you're going to enjoy this song. Here's J. Ray with "Baby Is You." From the east side to the west side and throughout the world. This is a Detroit original, Detroit Hot Radio. What is this feeling that I'm feeling? Hoping that it's real. 
it's got to be true In and out of emotion, trying to control it What do I do? This is new to me Never had someone make me feel like I do I'm not sure if I should hold on or should I let surprises and i love that man. i've heard a lot of music i know what i like i like that blues is our music for lack of a better term blues come from black people okay right. gospel is there it's, it's all there so when we hear right. it we know it you know what i mean it touches us as yeah. soon as we hear it we're like oh yes and some people say yes yeah. lord or yes baby <laughs> whatever it's still there i like that song what made you come up with that one? that's like very personal song like from the first time i thought i, I loved somebody so that's where the song comes from you thought you loved someone that's uh, deep man how you write a song about that most people won't do that. Sometimes I'm iffy about really putting my true thoughts and feelings into the music, but I realize that, you know, as an artist, 
sometimes that's the only outlet you might have. Mm -hmm. so music is pretty much the only outlet that I have. Andrea is an artist in her graphics. Some people are artists with the paintbrush, but we all release our inner feelings in our art, in our craft. Or it won't be unique. Right. But if you go deep right. within yourself, your own spirituality, you might find something. I really, really like that song. It's really spiritual. It really is. And I really like that you brought it home. What they say, down home. You know, you took it there. And that's beautiful. That shows how much talent you got. This next song, here's another one. You're not mine. Why do I like this song? We're gonna see this song, You're Not Mine. So we have a station identification, and then we'll go straight into J Ray, You're Not Mine. Listen to Let's Talk About It. I'm your host, T Pablo, and we'll be right back after this. From the east side to the west side and throughout the world, this is a Detroit original, Detroit Hot Radio. <laughs>
I'm United States Surgeon General Jerome Adams, America's doctor. And all across our nation, we've taken steps together to slow the spread of coronavirus. Now we must continue to take personal responsibility to protect ourselves and our loved ones. Because even though not all of us risk a severe case of coronavirus, we all risk getting it and spreading it to others, maybe without even realizing that we're sick. So if we want to get back to school, back to work, back to worship, and back to overall health, there are things our country needs to do. We need to follow state and local guidelines, take extra precautions if at higher risk, wash our hands frequently, stay six feet from others when we can, and when we can't stay six feet from others, please, I'm begging you, wear a face covering. These small actions will make a big difference. So I'm asking you to say it with me, America. Coronavirus stops with me. You can learn more at coronavirus.gov. Produced by the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services at taxpayer expense. All across the country, people are coming together to speed up what we can learn about health. The All of Us Research Program is calling on one million people to join us as we try to change the future of health. For your family, for future generations, for all of us. Visit joinallofus.org and find out how you can become one in a million. Now, on with the show. Right here on DetroitHotRadio.com. Man, Jerry. Yes, sir. I'm so proud to be sitting in this seat talking to you, brother. And I'm so proud that I can do this, you know, for artists. First of all, how did you come up with this song? So that song is uh, actually another true story. Like, I literally was having a dream about wow. this girl. Like, I was in a relationship, but I had never met this girl. I've never seen her day in my life, but I was having reoccurring dreams. <laughs> And so um, I wrote about it and I put it in the song. That's beautiful. I'm sure as young boys, we've all had those dreams. It's not a real girl, but it's the girl that your spirit would love. I've never seen this girl in my life, and but I can picture what she looked like and everything. Wow. If you ever see her, you're going to faint. Right. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to say. You're going to faint. I'm going to probably pass out or something like, wait a minute. <laughs> Uh, you gonna propose to her right there. That's a great song, Andrew LB. You got anything you would like to say to Jay Ray before we close the show out? I just want to say thank you. Um, thank you for sharing your voice with us. You know, it gives a sound that the music we don't hear anymore. Some of the the music is it, yours is different. Hey, Andrew, I wanted to say this and forgot, but you brought it up. Where have all the love songs gone? Now right. the thing about girls, they just want to literally pull their panties down. I mean, they don't have that romantic, yeah. let me show you, let me court you, let me, you look yeah. so beautiful to me. I mean, yeah, that's refreshing. Now go ahead, Andrew. Yeah, he gives that, and also he gives a beat that makes you want to move. I may be sitting there, but I hear it, and let's say I know I'm up on the floor. You're still talking about love, but you, you know, you're getting the people to move, and that's really unique. I really enjoy your music. Thank you. I appreciate it. Jay Hey Ray, is there anything you want to share about yourself, or, uh, your, where they can find your music, where you're working at, late, where they can find and catch your show, anything you want to say to everybody out there? First, I just want to say thank you, Tyra Radio, both you, T. Pablo, and to Andrea for the opportunity to be on Tyra Radio. Secondly, I just want to say I am working on my next two projects. I'm working on the EP as well as the sophomore album. I just hope people continue to listen and support. And you can stay connected with me on Instagram at I am Jare on Facebook, same thing at I am Jare. How do you spell Jare so they'll know? J A R A Y. The handle is at sign and then I am J A R A Y. Can they find your music on iTunes? I saw this on all of the online media sites that's on there. Well, I'm glad you said that because you can purchase for 99 cents any song that you heard by Jay Ray. This is significant. This is how you get your friends and family to support you. You say, well, look, it's just 99 cents. Give me some support. I won't forget you, number one. You're my people. And if I ever, you know, make it, we're going to bring something back. And just keep telling that. Buy my song. It only costs a dollar. I know you got a dollar. Maybe you 
ain't got time, but right. make some time. Just hook me up. <laughs> right. Make me a star for me. You know, hook me up. And I swear to God, I'm going to come back and make it happen. A lot of stars, they never say that. All right. So it was wonderful having you on the show. We here every Monday night. We're trying to bring the best to the listening public. We hope you enjoy what we bring. If you got any relatives or people that you know that's putting in the sweat equity to record their music and tell their stories, drop us a line. We're on Facebook and we got two pages. We got a group page that you can join. We got a fan page that you can like. You can leave a message on either one of those pages. We'll get back with you. Right, Andrea? That is correct. <laughs> Okay, so once again, it was fun having you, and thanks again, Andrew, for sitting in and keeping us company. You got to do that more often. I enjoy it. Without further ado, remember to love your ancestors, love your family, love your neighbors, love the creator. We got to love our craftsmen, the doctors and the builders. We need them. Love our talented children because they create some of the best moments in music and art and all these kind of things. It was nice having you on the show. Thanks for listening to Let's Talk About It with T. Pablo. Detroit Hot Radio, WDHR, the heart and soul of Detroit music. Thanks for listening. Be sure to tune in next week, same time, same station. Right here on DetroitHotRadio.com.